What's up YouTube? It's your boy Roman back at it again with another video and in today's video I'll be doing an unboxing and a quick setup of the Apollo 2 standard unit. So let's get started. Show you on the box. So what comes in the box, instruction manual, power cable, USB to connect to another miner for your full node, here's the unit itself, nothing on the side. Only a USB port and to plug in the power in the back. Nothing at the bottom. This is just a standard unit. In my other video, I unboxed and did a review on the Apollo 2 full node. So check that one out if you're interested. But with this unit, you plug it into either the Apollo 1 or the Apollo 2 to increase the hash rate. I am currently solo mining Bitcoin on my Apollo 1. So I'm going to plug this into this. And show you guys everything but before i plug it in i just want you guys to take a look at my screen show you some stuff so my Apollo 1 does 1.77 terahash currently. And I have about a 1 in 2 million chance to solve a solo block. When you click the overview, it shows on the right hand side I'm doing 120 watts at the wall. It shows my connections, how many blocks so far, and the blockchain size. Click the miner section. It shows my hash board. I have one hash board active. Show all data. 44 8 ASIC chips. So I'm going to plug in the standard unit now into my Apollo node. All right. Three, two, one. Very quiet. Unlike this one. When you turn this one on, it sounds like a jet. But this one, very quiet. So to get this working and to get this talking to this, all you have to do is go into your into the dashboard. Well, let me move this to the side, come back. top right here just click restart so it's restarting my Apollo 1 and my Apollo 2 at the same time so it both connects together and talks to each other Right now it's just connecting back to the internet, warming up, 
getting everything ready. So the standard unit is just like the Apollo 2. It does six terahash at about 185 watts and about 10 terahash at 450 watts. So as you can see on the right hand side, I'm currently pulling 328 watts at the wall now and doing around 7.36 terahash or now 6.84, which you understand what I'm trying to say. The terahash increased. <clears throat> you go to the minor section, now shows I have two hash boards active. Shows my the first one, the Apollo 2. 44 a6 and the Apollo 1 44 a6 both working and as you can see from the dash I'm gonna click solo mining it takes a while for the for the stats to uh, update but currently I was at uh, 2 million chance of solving a block and I would jump to 1.4 mil, 1 million and as the terra hash increases my chances will also increase so just watch it says um, right here my best share 9 million shows how much shares I've accepted so far how many is rejected shows when the last share was submitted and my uptime. So as you can see before, I was only at one point something terahash, and now it's at 3.28. And as, as it warms up, it's gonna increase to about maybe seven to nine terahash. So yeah, that's pretty much it. I wanna thank you guys for staying this long. If you enjoyed this video and learned anything from this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you have any questions, leave it in the comments and I'll reply as fast as possible. Please subscribe. In my next video, I'll be unboxing the Founders Edition, so stay tuned to that. Have a good day. Peace.